Hey, hey, welcome back. Now, today's episode is part two of a two episode series. So make sure you go back and listen to part one, which is episode 151. Now, top of mind awareness is the first brand product or service that comes to mind in a specific category or niche. So when I say phone, most people will think Apple. And same thing with coffee. Like, what do you think of? Most likely Starbucks, right? Even email, like you'll think Gmail because that's what you use. Am I right? Now, the whole goal of staying top of mind is that it will get you sales, referrals, and retain loyal customers. So how do you do this? What types of tactics can you implement in order to keep your business top of mind? Well, that's what today is all about, right? I'm sharing the five marketing tactics to do just that. Now, the first marketing tactic to stay top of mind is to stand out. Be visible. Being visible is the key to being and staying top of mind, right? You can do this with paid traffic. Now, here's the thing. You might be thinking, well, I could just do my email sequence. Yes, you definitely should be doing that too. But here's the thing. What happens is, is that you get the lead. They send, you send them their emails. How often are you actually going in your emails to see th- your emails, right? To read them. A lot of times they end up in the spam or the promo folder, so they don't even see it. But by putting your content in front of an audience that already kind of has become aware of you, right? They have that problem that you have the solution for. That's what you need to be is constantly be saying like, oh yeah, this is the girl that I got this free checklist from, right? They're not in the email inbox. I know for me, a lot of times I actually just did this weekend. I'm almost embarrassed to tell you how many emails I actually cleaned out, but there were so many emails thousands of emails that I had in my inbox. And I'm like, wait a minute, who is this person? What did they offer? What are they trying to say? And I just ended up deleting them because I don't know who they are, right? However, if I'm scrolling on social and I recognize somebody, I've been seeing them and I've been hearing them, when I got to the email, I can guarantee you I would not have deleted it. All right. Now, there are all kinds of strategies that you can use, and we definitely dive into that in my program, Your Traffic Factory. But here's the thing. You spent a lot of time and money to get the attention or to get that lead, right? Now it's the time for you to continue to build that brand awareness and stay visible so they can really get to know you, what you're about, and that you are the person to solve their problems. All right, the second marketing tactic to stay top of mind is to connect emotionally. Your audience wants to be inspired and emotionally connect with you, right? They want to feel like you're just like them, that you want to be like, they want to be your BFF, right? So when your message resonates top of mind awareness, it's amplified. So how do you connect emotionally? Well, instead of telling your audience, I help, blah, 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 right? Go deeper and connect with them at a higher level by telling them why you do what you do. Make sense? All right. The third marketing tactic to stay top of mind is to build an email list. Now, may it seem contrary to what I just said, but I did say you do need both. We all know that the importance of building an email list, right? It's the number one business asset that every company must have. You do not own your audience on social, right? The inbox is still the most direct way to connect with your leads and customers and stay top of mind. As long as your emails have purpose, they are consistent, and they have content that is relevant to what they want, not what you think they want, right? Especially with this Web 3.0 coming out, it's vital that you segment your list to send your subscribers the content that they are truly interested in and that will help them in their business. All right, the fourth marketing tactic to stay top of mind is to stay consistent. Consistency builds trust. Inconsistency breaks it. All right. So honestly, consistency is the reason why most online businesses fail, right? They often have irregular content posting, disappearing offers, and high employee turnover. So whether you struggle with consistency or not, you should definitely have systems and processes in place and someone to manage the projects and deadlines to help you and your team stay organized and remain consistent. 
The fifth marketing tactic to stay top of mind is to use a tagline or slogan. I mean, how often do you remember a slogan, right? It's like those, especially the kinds that stay stuck in your head, such a great, powerful way to stay top of mind. Now, consider creating an effective tagline or slogan that embodies your brand. So for example, mine is, let's grow your business together, right? Because I'm all about ads and funnels. It's all kinds of things that's going to help you grow. Then you're going to post it everywhere. Your website, your social channels, your email signature, your podcast episodes, maybe the way that you end, end something like in your video or your podcast, and definitely include it in your proposals, contracts, emails, reports. That's everywhere it's on mine, okay? And I would love to know what your tagline or slogan is. So send me a DM and let me know. All right, so those are the five marketing tactics. What are you going to be doing to stay vis visible? More importantly, how are you going to stay top of mind with the leads and customers that you already have? Start today and you'll see the time frame of when someone becomes a lead to when they become a buyer or a customer that window will shorten and how your sales conversions will start increasing. If you got value from this episode, I would love it if you can leave me an honest review over on iTunes. I appreciate you hanging out with me today. Cheers to staying top of mind with your audience. Until next time, let's grow your business together.